This is what an adjustment looks like at Y Bison Wellbeing. So first we go through and palpate the muscles of the back as well as the bones. See where things are statically. Tension patterns. Got some tension through the low back. So we want to make sure they're straight on the table. We do a flick of the ankles. That's a deep tendon reflex using the Achilles tendon. We check for a neurological legion. Here you have the left. When we rotate the head, it checks for different areas in the neck to see if there's a problem. So far, we're good. We're going to come up here and check the occiput. It's actually the most common adjustment, statistically. And we've got one coming up today. So we're going to go and check for rotational torque. What I'm looking for at the feet with the flick is for the legs to go perfectly even. So when the legs go even, it's similar to a cardiogram when the line goes even. It's not a good thing. So right there with left torque on his left occiput, we got legs perfectly even. So we're going to go and adjust. After each adjustment, we're going to go and pump the legs. Reset brings up the next layer that we can adjust. Resets the nervous system. And then we start from the top. With the feet, find which leg is short. He's left short. We're going to turn our head to the right and to the left. We'll do a soft tap on the leg so you know which way to turn. Back to center. We'll check the occiput again. This time it should be cleared out, and it is. We're screening for sacrum. So these light touches, the science behind it is that the nervous system and the skin are actually derived from the same embryological layer ectoderm so they've got a more intimate relationship so when we lightly touch the skin we can check neurologically what's going on in that area checking up here at the bottom of the neck got another perfectly even at c7 on the right we're going to check for torque Our left torque so we're going to check right torque all right right here we're going to adjust c7 pump the legs again clears the body out of gravity we can do up to three adjustments neurologically turn your hand to the right each adjustment is equivalent to nine structural adjustments. Turn your head to the left. Reason being is that a neurological adjustment is what we call a primary, so it's going to unlock several other secondaries or compensations for that spot in the spine. So even though it's very gentle, we're getting a lot of movement and big change with a simple adjustment. So these taps, what we're doing back and forth is just checking different areas. We re-engage the deep channel reflex and check the feet. When I brought them up before, you probably noticed up here. So this is a what we call a Deerfield check. Just checking through the hips and pelvis. Everything's clear for right now. We're going to go check C2. Okay, we got another even. So C2 can be left or right. So we're going to check both sides. Usually by palpating, you can kind of tell a little bit. We're going to check the right side first. We're going to check the left side. So each time I check that bone, I'm checking for different things, left and right, and then we check directional torque, so either left or right torque. We're going to check left torque. So most of the time you're on the table is spent assessing logically where we need to adjust. So even though we didn't adjust the low back, you can feel some of this muscular tension start to drop out because it's a global adjustment when we adjust each area and those compensations start to clear out. And then throughout the day as you walk around and move, you feel things continue to change and realign. Improve your well-being. That's it.